So, today's video topic is you are going to piss a lot of people off when you start to take life serious. All right? So, we are going to be talking about something that is going to happen when you decide, okay, I'm done bullshitting, I'm done playing around, I'm done being a part of this matrix. You are going to witness people's true colors and how they really feel about you, Gene. You are going to witness people just show up, expose themselves, because this is the end times, okay? So people's true colors are going to be revealed to you the moment you decide, okay, I'm done bullshitting with life. I'm tired of living in a repeated cycle. So you are going to see a lot of people, maybe your friends, family, shit, some of your hoes from the past, maybe a female you with right now, start to feel some type of way when you take this life shit serious, okay? <sighs> now, the reason that people are pissed off because you decided, okay, I want to take life serious, let me tell you why. It's actually two reasons. Number one, it's jealousy. Okay, now, if you are chosen right, you understand and know that you have the ability to see. So you can see shit that other people cannot see. So you may be a young man or a young woman on the come up in life. You know, you're starting to get into those years where you are becoming an adult. Okay? So you may be young and believe it or not, taking life serious at a young age is rare. Okay? It is very rare to see an individual with a mind on their shoulders, head on their shoulders, if I should say. So, you are going to experience jealousy because seeing somebody who is young in age, right? have so much wisdom it's intimidating to people so what I want to do is is this let me make one quick pause anyways I'm back but like I said seeing an individual at a young age take life so serious like that it's very intimidating and it's scary and you gotta understand, me and you, right, we are young, but we have wisdom beyond our years, okay? Some of the stuff that me and you have been bestowed with, you will not have learned these things unless you experienced it or you lived long enough to see it. So people are jealous of that. They are very jealous of your intellect. They are jealous. That's what it is, G. Because at their age, they were not thinking on this level like you. They were not. I'm going to keep it a bug. Any motherfucker who ordered to me, I could tell them to their face. You were not smarter than me at this age, and that's on my life. You get what I'm saying? The average motherfucker who have lived life and they like 30, 40, 50, I will tell them to their face, you were not as disciplined and intellectual and have as much wisdom at this age compared to me. When I was, I'm 21 right now. Individuals who was 21, when they were 21, they didn't have the shit that I had. So it's jealousy because you gotta understand, it's like, damn, bro. He or she figured this shit out so early like that. Imagine 
what I would have been like if I figured this shit out. And it's not supposed to be that way, ladies and gentlemen. So, out of jealousy, right? They get mad at you because you decided to take life serious. Believe it or not, people want you to be ain't shit like them. Believe it or not, people want you to be low lives with no sense of purpose like them. Nobody wants you to be better than them. Nobody wants you to be better off without them. Okay, we're dealing with narcs. You think people would be astonished by your intellect, your wisdom, and your discipline for your age, but no, it, it turns into jealousy inevitably because deep down, right? Most people my age and my age group, I say 23 and below, don't have this type of discipline or wisdom. You know, their their mind is everywhere. They're scatterbrained. You feel me? They are not focused individuals. So when you exuberate when you exuberate high level intellect, you show that you are disciplined for real, for real. You show that you got focused you feel me you have a sense of focus it becomes a problem to people because only a select few of men and women across the globe are really like this so because you have all these things at a young age that means you will be able to do a lot more than these individuals and that's what they fear now it's not supposed to be like this they're supposed to be congratulating you like wow but that's not what it that's not what it is, G. People don't want you to be great because they are not great or they never will be great. You get what I'm saying? So when you are exuberating these traits, G, you know deep within yourself you can accomplish 30, 40, 50, 100 times more than the average individual because you figured it out while you was young. You didn't wait or figure this shit out later on in life because you chose him. The Bible tells us many are called few are chosen so because you figure these things out you are taking life serious you understand how the matrix is you understand that everything is a distraction you understand that time is valuable it's the most important and precious thing we all got and it's not to be wasted it's to be used we don't let time use us we use time Get what I'm saying So look Let me one quick pause right quick Anyways I'm back But like I said We don't let time use us We use time You get what I'm saying Because we know that time can be a weapon If used and executed wisely But also time can be our enemy So we don't waste time no more Our foot is on the gas We put the pedal to the metal on our grind goals and purpose because we know that we have a lot to do and accomplish in this life and people hate that people hate that you have that energy to keep going no matter what situation you are in you could be in a worse spot than somebody else and just seeing with this energy this life this tenacity this drive to keep going it bothers people G because they lack these traits within themselves and they don't know how to acquire your light they don't know how to acquire your inner peace, your strength, your drive, your inner fire. They don't know how to acquire it because they lack these things. They didn't work on these things at a young age. Okay? So, you're going to piss a lot of people off when you start to take life serious. Real shit. A lot of people don't take life serious, G. So, when... So when people see that you actually taking life serious, you understand this shit, you see what's going on, you're not gonna allow this society, this system, to make you fall and backpedal because that's what this shit is. This society literally launches you into the middle of nowhere and then all you know is, damn, the matrix. 
So now you end up in this cycle, this loop, this continuous loop to nowhere. You feel me? So you're gonna piss a lot of people off when you start taking life serious because they didn't do it. Even if they may have gotten a financially stable crib, maybe a car, but they're jealous of you because you're doing it at a young age. So that means if you figured it out young, what happens when you get older, late 20s, early 30s? You will be unfuckable. You will, you will have conquered and accomplished so much in this life because you had the ability to see. Like I said, many are called, few are chosen. You get what I'm saying? Everybody is not chosen, G. Some of these people are bots, agents, demons, spies. And then you got me and you, light barriers, light workers, children of the most high. So you're gonna piss people off, G. You're gonna piss off your friends when you start to take life serious, G, because they aren't taking life serious because they don't know what you know and they don't have the passion or drive or courage or what's the word? Ethics to take this shit serious because people is lazy, G. So when you exuberate mental, physical, and spiritual fortitude, it becomes a problem. Um, you may start to lose friends the moment you take life serious. And it's okay because those individuals at a young age who don't take life serious, and I'm talking about 18 and up, maybe 17 and up, you get what I'm saying? That's as low as I'm going. Those individuals who don't take life serious, they gonna look at you funny because they goofy. Bro, believe it or not, these people are childish, G. And I mean that on every level. It doesn't matter how old you are, G. As a man, if you don't got no discipline, you ain't got no wisdom. You ain't got the mental fortitude. You are a child, G. You could be 36. You could be 40 and still have the mind of a child because you don't have your priorities in straight. You don't have your priorities in check. So you still will have the mind of a child doing certain things like chasing these pleasures, stuff like that. Shit that this matrix conditioned you to do. But when you do things that's easy, life becomes hard. But when you do what's hard, life becomes easy. It does. I said this shit in one of my videos earlier today, I believe. So yeah, you're gonna piss a lot of people off when you take life serious because motherfuckers just don't get it until it's too late. Until life beat they ass up. They don't get it, but see me and you get it. So we're not gonna allow this system, this society to fuck us over and keep us in a loop, G. And keep us with depression, anxiety, fear. We good, G. We came here to walk in love, faith, inner strength, okay? We came here to walk in our divinity, G. So there is no fear anymore. There is no fear of failing anymore. We're going after it and we're gonna get it because we know we can get it. That's the difference between me and you and the masses they don't know they can do it they don't know that they could do what they can do you feel what i'm saying but we know we can do it it's a difference when you think you can do it and when you know and me and you know we can do it so because we know we can do it nothing is going to hold us back and we won't allow anything or anybody to hold us back you get what i'm saying so look anyways i'm gonna go ahead and end the video off i love you guys so much y'all stay tuned for more content and yeah i'm gonna work on my game